Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. We're doing general energy readings, and this is for January 2nd and 3rd for Cancer. As always, I use my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards for my general readings, my general energy readings. And um, this is, you know, I will always tell you that this is general reading, so please take what you like, leave the rest. It may or may not resonate you. Um, also, too, I have prayed, meditated, and put infused with Reiki energy. So let's see what general energy is going to be for Cancer. Cancer, I do want to thank you, everybody. Um, this morning I woke up, checked my YouTube, and found out that we, and I say that we because this is our journey together. You've been with me since the start. We have reached 2,500 members as subscribers. Wow. That blew me away, so thank you. Um, you know, if you haven't subscribed, okay, you want to, yeah, you kind of bounced out here. If you have, if we haven't subscribed, then please go below, hit subscribe. And if you are one of my wonderful subscribers and you know how much I love to hear from you, please share, share. Let's see if we can pop this up to 3,000. That would be great, wouldn't it? I'd like it. Um, okay, first card, this came reversed. And you know there's a little bit more emphasis on this. This is Six of Water. Water being your sign. And this is memory from your history or childhood issues regarding children. Romanticizing the past. Now this one, you know, normally I call this kind of my nostalgic card. But this one I'm thinking is going to be more with... That issues regarding children is popping at me a little bit more. Um... It, you may not have children, so let's put this as family. There may be some family issues going on. There may be, you know, they might, they might not necessarily, now that if you celebrate holidays, now that the holidays are over, they're just kind of like all wired up. I'm talking about young people, children. Or just, I'm just, or now that it's all over, things that you put on hold, anger, not anger per se, but um, domestic. I'm thinking more domestic issues are going to come forward in these next two days, you know, the second and third. This one is reversed. Let's see. This is the three of Earth. Earth is our Virgo, our Capricorn, and Taurus energy. Power of creativity, recognition for high quality work, being a team player. Okay, let's see. This last card is strength. Okay, strength. Archangel power here. Um, great inner strength, release harsh judgment, forgiveness, and compassion. So what I'm seeing is that there's going to be some sort, you're going to be dealing with some issues here. You may be called to compromise. You may not necessarily like those compromises. Those compromises may not necessarily be what is good for whoever and whatever this is. So, you know, maybe even though I say you might be asked to compromise, it doesn't mean that you have to compromise. Because if this is showing that you're going to be needing a lot of strength. So you may be battling, you may be battling, um, you may be finding yourself in a battle, okay? And not quite sure, it, it might be a domestic issue, it might be a domestic issue, but you will find, you will actually, I mean, it could be at work too. It could be at work, I'm feeling more of a domestic, but it could be at work too, where you're, but again, it's like you're, you have a battle. It's like you're, you're battling something, you're fighting something. I don't, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to tell you not to lose your temper, because step back, because the other, the other party will want you to lose your temper. Don't lose your temper. Stay calm and just keep going the way you're supposed to go, okay? Because you will need strength in cancer. I know that you would rather have everything, you know, like, you know, you're, you're such home buddies. You don't want to have to fight. But, you know, but nobody really knows that you can be a very strong fighter. You can be very strong in fighting. So keep it calm. Keep it cool. Be prepared to go into a battle these next two days, the second and third. But you will have the strength to carry this through. And I do think, you know, I do think that you're going to, you know, it says release harsh judgment and forgiveness and um, you know, forgiveness and compassion. Yes, you need to have that. You need to be understanding, but at the same time, you need to be, you need to be, what do I want? Um, you need to do what's right, okay? So do what's right. 
You will have the strength for it. Okay, good luck. Good luck. I'll keep you all more so. I keep every, all of my subscribers in my prayer, but I'll say a special one for you. Okay, Cancer? Okay, thank you again. I, you know, I wish that this was a little more positive, but you know what? Being told that you might have, that you will have the strength to carry through your battle, that's, I think that actually is pretty positive. We all have battles, but yours is coming upon you a little bit sooner. So, thank you again, Cancers. Subscribe, share, tell people. Let's get this up. And just please know, as always, that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.